don't know if Chanel has dated any firefighters, but she has been called a hot mama more than once. And she describes herself as very naughty and very flexible. I've always been active from school. I've always been in cheerleading, volleyball, basketball, track. I don't like any guy to tell me what to do or how to live my life. I'm very flirty. I am very flirtatious. I love a strong, assertive man, but yet I like a man to like let me be me and let me take control. Okay, so Chanel wants a guy who's macho yet sensitive. Well, I think you'll all agree that her date fills the bill. His name's Melvin, and he's a licensed manicurist. I went to Career Academy of Beauty. As soon as I walked in the door, oh, you want a pedicure? I said, no, I'm here to go to school. They all laughed at me. And I would do their nails, do their pedicures, do stuff like that. And I just kept doing it just because I liked it. You know what I mean? I didn't have nothing else to do. I never would think a guy over 250 pounds could be gentle on a girl's nail. Actually, you'd never think a guy his size could be gentle on anything. So let's check out Chanel and our gentle giant in action. Thank you. Okay. You all set? Yeah. Okay. So how many years have you been training? Um, actually, I started uh, lifting weights when I was 13, so this is like my 17th year. Uh -huh. Just recently got my pro card. I won the USA. Did last you? Year. Yeah. Congratulations. So I went to school while I was dieting to be a manicurist. So that's but what you I went did. to school to be a manicurist? Mm -hmm. Because oh I wanted really? something that they couldn't take from me. You oh know my what I mean? god, that is like. Yeah, the hardest thing is polishing your own nails or mm -hmm. polishing someone else's nails. Mm -hmm. you, have to, you have to do it in three strokes. Mm -hmm. So I just kept doing it, kept doing it, couldn't get it right. And I was ready to quit. Finally learned it. Hello, welcome to Juice It Up. We're gonna start off with some wheatgrass. Have you had that before? I have. What we're gonna get you guys to do is uh, take a cut from the root here and you just put it in here and uh, the juice will come up here. How much, a handful? Yeah, pretty decent sized handful. And it's root grass? Wheatgrass. Wheatgrass. Don't look at her, you won't be able to eat it. See, I'm a diehard though. I know you had it like that. Huh? So I know you had it like that. Yep. Dang. Can I let you out to me here on the beach, you know? You're gonna get a ticket. Okay. You have a ticket for getting That's too okay. much That's okay, I've got plenty of them. <laughs> <laughs> I have headlights. Watch out. Yeah, go ahead and pump some iron. Okay, you, you go, then I'll go. This is a strip show, where the dollars at? See, I have nothing to take off though. <laughs> Nothing to take off though. Man, I'm gonna freeze my ass off Let's see those hot buns. Give me a hot bun contest. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Don't get lazy on me now. Oh, okay. That's one. Uh oh. Two. <laughs> Hungry, what about you? Yeah. I must feed my muscles. I try not to. <laughs> Ooh, whoa. So, we have a little game we play at I'm gonna throw some rice and you gotta catch it. You ready? I gotta catch it? Yeah, I'll put your mouth. Oh! Oh, my mouth! Oh, my mouth. Oh, my mouth. Oh, my Okay, my turn. Skill. <laughs> okay, you ready? <laughs> you want my tail? Yeah, but not that one. Oh, not the hard, crusty kind. Yeah. You want the soft round? The soft round inside, yeah. So what about, you know, your preparation for a show? I mean, is there like sex before show? Do you have the restraint from sex? 
What is the deal? What's going on? Actually, after maybe seven days before the seven show. Seven days? Well, that's not bad. You can put out the seven I got two days. Weeks, I got two weeks leeway time. You can put out the seven days. Maybe I'll days get lucky. <laughs> seven days is not bad. I held out for like six months. Huh? Me and no booty they months? The hell is wrong with you? You're not gonna tell me where we're going? I'm just we're going to my house, but I'm not telling you what's the surprise. Oh, we're going to your house, and there's like surprise waiting for me. Yeah. Is it like wrapped like a I big ain't glow? telling you nothing. This chair here is fine. Okay. <clears throat> we're going to get a pedicure. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> but I have to set up, so just relax. <laughs> Polish remover. Let me melt this water. You're super. just doing too much. Hmm? You're trying to get like brownie points here, aren't you? Yeah, actually Aww. I am. It's a scrub. Oh, so it feels gonna feel like for a scrub. Just for the rough spots, you know? Oh yeah, right there. Mmm. It's like an apricot. Yeah, uh, that's good. So how many inches are your um, biceps there? My biceps are 21. Damn, that's like my waist. Mm -hmm. 21 and a half? Is yeah. that by, by Without right? Without a pump. Without a pump? You go, boy. <laughs> and let me see what else I want to like measure. Let me hug. Aww, thank so, you. Have that a great was time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> have a nice time too, okay? Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye. Well, you'd think that after all that attention to Chanel's toes, that maybe Melvin might have gotten some TLC himself. Well, they'll tell us if there are more foot rubs in the future right after this. Welcome back to Blind Date. Now, before the break, Chanel and Melvin's date went from a very physical encounter on the beach to what else but a very gentle pedicure back at Melvin's place. So let's see how these two fitness buffs felt about the date and each other. Physically, she didn't seem like she was intimidated by my size as much as a normal girl would be. The pedicure was nice. It was wonderful. It was sensuous. It was romantic. It was very sweet. Start with the feet. You know, the pants come next. Always. I think that maybe I would like to go out with him again. i definitely probably go out with her again, yeah. So they'll be going out again definitely, probably. Whatever that means. We wish them well either way. Stick around, there's more Blind Date coming up. Wardrobe by silvercurtain.com.